Grace, thank you. In this morning's Money Watch, some Apple users experienced a glitch yesterday afternoon. Yeah, they certainly did. And American Airlines expects its full plane fleet to be back this spring. Jane King is live in New York following these stories for us. Jane. Yeah. Hey, Ted Mercury, good morning. Certainly some more good news for airlines. We've gotten a, quite a few pieces of this lately. So American anticipates most of the aircraft will be active in the second quarter of this year. This is more travelers, book flights, vaccine eligibility expands as well. Now, as of yesterday, American Airlines said its seven-day moving average of net bookings is 90% of the 2019 average. Well, some Apple users yesterday reportedly experiencing some glitches with certain apps and services, according to the company. Now, the issue started to occur around 1 p.m. Eastern Time, and some of the affected apps and services included the App Store, iCloud Mail, iMessage, among others. By 2.30, the company's status page says everything was back to normal. And oil prices remain high, even though the ship stuck in the Suez Canal was freed. Traders expect shipping delays to persist as there were hundreds of ships waiting to get into the Suez Canal. So we're going to be uh, dealing with this for a couple more weeks now. Well, the Dow closed at a record high yesterday. S&P and NASDAQ were down, though, and today it looks like we'll open about 50 points higher. Live from New York, I'm Jane King. Back to you. All right, Jane, we'll be sure to check back with you tomorrow. Thanks so much. Okay.